there are cases that I need to set my view range in a specific area that differs from the view range of the whole plan. Let's say I have two rooms where the ceilings are located at 3500 millimeters height and the room in the middle where the ceiling is located at 2600 millimeters height. If I go back to the ceiling plan and type VR to see the current view range, I can see that cut plane offset is set to 3500 millimeters height. And as a result, in the ceiling plan, I cannot see the ceiling which is located in the middle room because it's positioned lower than the current view range of the whole plan. But it's there, I can see it in the 3D view. So what I can do is go to the view tab, create panel, click on the drop down arrow of the plan views, choose plan region, select rectangle if it's appropriate, draw a sketch on the area I want to change the view range at. Press escape a couple of times, go to properties, edit, and let's say I wanted to change it to 2600 millimeters height. Click OK. Finally click finish. Press escape a couple of times. I can now see all the settings at the same time. If I hover over it, I notice the dashed line. If I click on it, I can stretch its boundaries or I can edit its boundaries. I can change its view range from here or I can change the view range if I go to properties click on edit and I can change the view range from here as well again I could have set the view range of the whole plan lower and see all the settings at the same time but this is just an example to show you that the plan region feature is there